Hello, Galaxy Heroes. Um, I'm struggling to find footage. I know I was having a lot of issues last night. In fact, my alt had uh, one of the battles freeze, uh, three on four. But I was having some issues last night. Uh, hopefully, I will find the rest of them. But this, um, this one here, of course, um, is minus uh, a virus. Ventress, Hassard Ventress. Wow. Suddenly had a mental block on her name. So this is minus her uh, because she was in the Dooku match. And hadn't thought about <coughs> sorry, excuse using spirit. Um but of course spirit debuffs on not debuffs. Um removes buffs on her special and she's got that foresight and she hits pretty hard um yeah so this is my night sister run mother tails in lead obviously well not obviously but it is a mother tails in lead um and it's me just running around trying to get them all with plague and then get rid of the medics prevent um the revives so yeah focusing down here as you can see on said medic but although they'll revive um, if we get it right uh, they'll be gone beforehand okay so they stealth uh, I don't think stealth's going to help you from plague Will be in the last person left. So then you're not stealthed. Ha ha. But there we go. Round one done. Opt to go for the stun first of all. There's the medic. I get a stun on them as well. So there's two with plague already, and two of them out of the offing for a moment. First one back in play. And of course this is where Sarge really comes in with their ability to just remove all buffs. That wonderful swoosh and it's all gone. And uh, I don't have a Zeta on my Daka so I'm not benefit. No one's actually benefiting or boosting as far as I'm aware from the zombie multiple deaths, which is a shame. And never mind. It is what it is. But there you go, pop it again. Took a little while for that to come through, but it's there. Um, Mother Towson's got her unique Zeta as well as her lead. So <laughs> her turn meter's gonna be climbing as soon as. She's ready to go. Zappity zap. Want that medic gone? That medic, I think, is, yeah, gone. We can safely say. Sorry, I got distracted by the cricket. Ooh, it's gonna be close. It's, um, it's the ICC World Cup 2019 and England are playing India, and India need 137 runs from 82 balls. Just in case you're wondering, that's where I am right now. So, where are we right here? So we're into phase three now, yay. Who do I pick on? Who's gonna get it? The clone trooper's gonna get it. really do need to read up and see what all their abilities are and who I should and shouldn't be targeting. Normally I target the revivers and if I can I get rid of any tune that I recognize on their side i.e. Mace, Kit Fistu, Eve Kof, Luminara, 
all of them, all of these Galactic Republic tunes, which uh, we can't say for sure, because um, not every um, territory battle tune that we come across actually is in game as such, well, as in playable by us. Um, those ones are, and there's been lots of communications, I believe, about light side reworkings on Galactic Republic. Yeah, I'm wandering off away from the subject here. So it takes a while to put these down. That's basically why I'm waffling. But we're slowly getting there. There's another one gone. Now we're gonna <clears throat> just, yeah. I'm trying to get them all down, I think, and then just zap the healthiest one and hoping that the rest will go. But at the moment, that's not quite happening. But we're almost into the last round. And my daughter's decided that now's the time to play really loud music and get me copyright whatever hopefully that's not coming through um boom so final encounter um happy days it's it's an all clone affair there are no uh there's no shack t there's no mace windu there's something on my screen i'm blowing at but uh yeah so although there are some nasty clones here, the nice thing is, of course, is that with the Night Sisters, that they, um, they kind of don't die. Well, they do die, but they don't die. As long as key tunes don't die, Night Sisters don't die. So, yeah. So it can look quite bad. I remember when they were first launched. Look, there we go. We've lost one here. Uh, lost one. We've actually lost the main one. Mother Towson, but in some ways you kind of want her dead because every time somebody uses a basic, oh right, I'll brought her back into the game. But every time she went, she was just zapping them and stealing health through the plague that she's inflicted or her lead has inflicted. A big AOE, share some more, Talia. I'm not sure why they weren't healing there. Am I missing some sort of... I don't understand why Talia's kind of... All right, I understand why she is, because... She... Oh, actually, yeah, of course, because she did the heal. There we go. And then Daka's done her heal. And Talia's here. Just two things, because she's got the two specials, which will potentially inflict plague, Plus, she's also going to heal on her basic. And she can heal and cleanse on the special. So, yeah, she's she's just... That was my thinking. I mean, my other, my other options there were to um, either put in Acolyte or... Um, or initiate. My initiate actually is is not really viable. My initiate's uh, only gear eight, I believe. And that client, I basically I wanted the heal. I really, I, yeah, I just wanted the heal. Um, I didn't want to leave it all down to Dakar. I mean, because what would happen if I lost Dakar? Oh wait, no, I lost Dakar. There she is. She keeps trying, lover. Um, I'll keep doing the basics because that will bring her in. Or ha yeah, it will. Doesn't guarantee her coming in, I think. But yeah. Last roll of the dice. Yay! And she finishes the battle. So there we go. Uh, Mother Tails in without uh, a Sarge Ventress, and we do the four stars. Okay, this one here, I this this is just painful. So this one should hopefully be speeded up, because um, yeah, I I don't know, I don't know what led me to, 
I don't have either Zeta on my Vader, um, but I was trying it. I was trying the palps. Uh, spoiler alert, this, um, yeah, this isn't the best of runs. And of course, having the talk there is just, yeah. I'm stuck behind. I was, I'm in an R in on who to bring in. Um, I brought in Tarkin because he does have that turn meter removal. Um, and it hits relatively hard plus it also, um, I think it puts extra damage over time, which is what Vader works on and just, yeah. Just trying to buff them to death. But I looked a couple of times. I've got Thrawn. Obviously, Thrawn can do the fracture. Um, but even so, I was just wondering whether or not uh, Death Trooper. I, I opted not to use Death Trooper just because... And this sounds stupid, maybe. But because their clones are not rebels, there's not going to be any double taps. So I'm not going to get the absolute benefit of the um the days although on hindsight that might have worked with the with the taunters because obviously he'll have had to have hit them but yeah um hopefully we yeah we are whizzing through the other thing is of course they just take all of them take so much hitting before they actually go down Um, yeah, so each one, well, I am looking through all my long video clips to find my Dooku and my, um, my Akle. I'm thinking my subconscious might have hidden my Akle because that wasn't very pretty at all. A bit like this empire. Um, where are we? Three or four. Okay. So, <clears throat> we're still doing okay. Um, Shaw's got a shred, so I am gonna lose Shaw unless I can get Shaw to do some heal. No, okay, Shaw is down. We're still on three or four, can we? Right, we've got palps to heal. Come on, we must, we're gonna get rid of There's no medic, is there? Okay, so again, with the taunt. Fortunately, it's, um, does it keep hitting? Robbie the robot? No, 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 it's hitting all of us. Okay, so we got Thrawn in, in to get rid of that taunt. Can we get through at least to the final round? Come on, guys. Ooh. Okay, so one left. If we can keep him stunned, that would be great because he's not going to inflict any damage. Keep, no, we're not keeping him stunned. There's Trooper. And yay. So we're through to the last round. Um, okay, we've got Jedi Vanguard. Um, and we know that if he takes his mask off, he's actually Jody Bindu underneath him. Oh, and we got Isla. But I have fractured her. Because <coughs> again, she's got all that countering and everything. And she'll call assist. There's a Jedi over there. We don't really want him assisting. Um, but we've lost Tarkin already. And it's not looking good. Yeah, it's really not looking good. Oh, lost palps, and that is it. That's my run. Thank you for watching.